There we go. Our news broadcast brought to us by Julia Weber. All right. Monday, March 5th, Law of Science. We have the, she will point to her Vanna pose, oblique triangle. We also will have the solvent oblique triangle. And don't forget, we're going to also study laws. Obviously, the coyote did not study law. And then we have angle, angle side. Oh, and we have umpires. Oh, nope, that's the American Softball Association. Really not, it's angle, side, angle. A donkey? Really, Coach Donnie? Oh, yes, because it's the ambiguous case of SSA. Obviously, can't put it the other way. And then, what is that? Oh, not area 51, but the area of an oblique triangle. All right. So then on Wednesday, we'll be taking the SAT test for the juniors. And everybody else will be taking a fitness test. Woohoo, fitness, right? <laughs> All right. And on March, Thursday, March 8th, Coach Tony has left the building. I'll be at a tournament. Ooh, what do we have here? Well, I guess we have a choice law of science or cosines. Which one is best? It goes back to the election. All right. And then we have law of cosines. We have the nice little um, car there. I don't remember why. <laughs> All right. Then we have the nice little dragon for SSS because it kind of made a bunch of S's in there. S dragon S. All right. Oh, and Julia's up there because she's so sassy because that's what we're going to have, the SAS. All right. And then we also have Heron's area formula. Yay for Heron. Woo. We'll learn a little bit about her. And the formula for area of a triangle. And then don't forget, on Friday, we're going to finish up with the same stuff. And after that, will obviously be spring break. Any last words, Julia? Have a good day. <laughs>